artist descending a staircase by Tom, Tom Stoppard. A very, very interesting, very good play. Which, uh, on first, uh, on listening to it first, uh, did not strike me as what I generally like. Uh, there are absurd aspects within. There is a humor which um, I do not uh, particularly enjoy uh, on a regular basis. Um, but then, with insight, with explanations, um, an introduction, very good. Um, some very good points are made at the beginning of this uh, uh, story, uh, play, I'm sorry, uh, by a man who used to be the drama director for the, uh, the BBC, uh, probably the one responsible for the programs, uh, uh, drama program, programs on the famous uh, channel. Um, and we learn, the audience, the auditors learn that um, this was a play created specially for the radio and some, um, some elements were intended for this medium and we can only get them with the radio. For instance, um, their, um, their pretending, characters are pretending that they're riding on horseback, but they're using coconuts. Um, moving in what I feel is a bit absurd, one of them says to the other, uh, coconut, that's a name, that's an interesting name for a horse. But Napoleon wouldn't call his horse coconut. Um, then, uh, they, uh, they um, talk about art, they're artists, all three main characters are artists. Uh, there is also Sophie who comes into play. She's not an artist. She's a blind character. That's a, also a, an intriguing uh, element. Um, and it, the, the point being there, on a side note, uh, as explained by uh, the author, uh, to have someone who uh, listens like we listen on the radio or another medium to uh, the play. Um, on stage, uh, it's an awkward situation when you, you, you see what's happening and it doesn't have the same effect. In fact, they speculate that maybe the effect is lost when uh, the artist has this in mind. Um, uh, Uh, rendering the image of people playing ping pong, but they don't play ping pong. You hear it on a recording, you hear it, and you can imagine something. But when you see it, it's lost somehow. And the last example in the sense has to do with an installation of uh, art, uh, which one is better off imagining than seeing because seeing it would not look like what we would imagine. Uh, perhaps it's a bit complex and I didn't really manage to, um, to explain much. Uh, it's true, I already mentioned that the play is um, not my usual uh, stable, um, but there are very interesting elements. There is also a, um, in the plot, um, the insinuation of a murder story. Uh, Donna, one of the artists, uh, three friends, dies. Uh, he's dead at the bottom of the stairs and Beaufort 
is suspecting his friend. In fact, it gets funny uh, when he says, well, you had only two friends uh, in the world. And since you killed one, not in those words, since you killed one, uh, you better be uh, careful with the, uh, with the other. Um, so there are that these elements of, of uh, humor, and um, the play is serious, uh, though. Even if um, I've listened after the play to a um, little interview with the author, with Tom Stopper, who said he liked to have uh, some fun uh, with this uh, medium. But even if the play was also put on stage.